are you doing? Fine, you know, apart from the whole wake thing. Yeah. Anyone else here yet? Susan's here already. And she's brought Michael. Fuck. I didn't think coming to Mum's funeral could be any more depressing. I can't even remember what he does. Is Auntie Anne not here? Said she couldn't make it, but um, she sent me a moon pig of her crying on it, though. Thoughtful. Yeah, I know. Anyway, come on in, make small talk, and um, make sure Susan doesn't find the backup Prosecco. Yeah. Mm. Hey, Sus. Amy. Michael, hi. Hello. You are right, Sus? Should have never gone to that pit and zoo. So how are you doing, sis? Big literary agent. Shit. Currently representing the author of what we're branding. Fifty Shades of Grey, but with more lesbians. Is that any good? No. Yeah. Sounds like a winner. Fifty Shades isn't even relevant anymore. I mean, say we're lesbians. Now that they can marry, no one gives a shit. What glass is that, Sus? It's my fifth, you must know. Seriously? Oh, God, no, I'm joking. It's my fourth. Anyway, it's not me you should be worried about. It's the food. I mean, that is the most fight buffet I've ever seen. And I've been to one of them gay weddings. And they were both estate agents! What's them being estate agents got to do with it? Dirty fuckers. Right. Well, it's not that phallic. Look, he's got scotch eggs. Balls, Amy. Balls. I think it's a cry for help. Michael would know about those. Wait, what? Nothing. Uh, how's it going with you two, anyway? Great. Great. And what about you, Michael? How is the world of... Quantity surveying. Right, quantity surveying. Still surveying those quantities? Well, actually, awesome. It's... I think Graham needs me in the kitchen. Your flies are undone. Hey, do you know any estate agents? What? No. Why? Never mind. Everything all right? We'd be going better if Susan wasn't drinking every drop of carver she laid her eyes on. Quantity surveyor. What? What Michael does, he's a quantity surveyor. Oh, that is so like him. I know. This might sound weird, but he kind of smells like urinal cakes. Good to know you're working these things out. Well, we have an actual cake coming. For a wake? Yeah. Susan ordered it, you know, well. A cake for a wake? A wake cake, yeah. Maybe it will become a thing. Yeah, maybe. I think I got lice from just looking at that delivery guy. Suze, do you actually know anything about this cake? Uh, no. Well, I'm looking forward to it, Suze. Thank you, Amy. You know, I like to think I retain my class and taste after the third bowl. Shit! Fuck. It's what she would have wanted. How do you figure that? Well, Dad had been dead five years. <laughs> Not funny, Amy. <laughs> Come on, Graham, it was kind of funny. Oh, she's treating it like a fucking hen do. Might as well hire a stripper and put the fucking weather girls on. I mean, what next? She's got a little midget in a funny costume hidden somewhere. At least it fits the theme. What theme? <laughs> Never mind. Maybe they were out of happy waking cakes? Fuck's sake, Amy, this is our mum's wake. You two seem to just be taking the piss. I know, Graham, I'm sorry. Maybe this is just her way of coping. What? By getting pissed and buying cock cakes? I want strength WKD till it came out of both holes when I was getting through a rough patch. Jesus, Amy. Please, just look after her and make sure she doesn't find the rare sick. Christ, how many types of wine did you buy? Okay, sure. Just shout if you need anything, okay? Jesus, Suze, are you all right? Hey, come on now. Everything is shit, Amy. Everything is shit and her mum dies. Everything's a bit much. Oh, my job's a fucking joke. Says you, I'm a bloody receptionist. At least you've got clients. <laughs> yeah, 50 shades of fucking gay. Good one. Thanks. What about Michael? Fucking Michael. Yeah, good point. 
she was one of the not so shit things, you know? Yeah. Well, how about me? Am I shit? Well, no, not really. Let's get through this. Just gonna go get some candles. What? Susan! Candles! For the cake! Hello! Hi. Susan! Sorry for your loss. I'm sorry. She should never have gone to that petting zoo. Oh, right. I'm terribly sorry. It's been a long day. Remind me how you know... Oh, my... Pam, from the post office. Your mum used to pop in for cards, stamps, stationery, right. envelopes. OK, you're a tad early, but since you're here, everyone, Pam's here! Who the fuck is Pam? You're very welcome to come in. Pam, Michael, Michael, Pam. Hello. Hi. Like a house on fire. Well, I'm just going to go and check on something in the kitchen. Oh, Christ, not you as well. Well, it is a fucking wake, Amy. Sorry. Susan was in a bit of a state upstairs. Is she under control now, though? She's gone to get candles. Fucking hell. It's a mess, isn't it? Susan's gone AWOL. Everything looks like a dick. No, it... Don't. <laughs> Yeah, okay. And now fucking Pam's here! What? Nothing, Nothing Pam. Pam! Surreal, you know. That we'll never see her again. She always knew what was up. Not just with herself, but with everyone else. And I don't even know what's going on with me. I can't even put on a proper fucking wake for her. She would have liked it. It's bordering on fast. Exactly. Listen, if you ever need to talk about anything, penis food or whatever, I'm willing to therapise the shit out of you, okay? You're too smart to be a receptionist, you know? And you're not boring enough to be an accountant. Okay, I've had to talk over. I'm gonna go powder my nose. Duty, where'd you get those? A back alleyway, where do you think? I mean, it's trustworthy, he had a beard. People get stopped in airports for that. Oh, you always were a dollar, Graham. You can keep it together for one day, could you, Susan? Hey, look, it's not my fault today's gone to shit. I mean, you couldn't even organise a hand job in a way that's just have a glass of water, Susan. I'm fine. Look, I'm nailing this. Michael? Pam! Michael! Pam, you dog! Pam, you bitch! Uh, uh, sorry. The fuck? We're grieving. Oh, I'm gonna kill this too. Yeah. She's not worth it. What do you mean, not worth it? Shut, Shut up, Pam. Pam! I think one breakdown's enough for today, Susan. Wait, what? You told him? Oh, it's all right. He had a cry as well. Amy! What? I'm just saying, everyone's sad. Yeah, except you. Going around making sarky comments like it's a fucking improv workshop. Yeah. Pam! Michael! I said I'm sorry! I'm just trying to keep it together for everyone else, okay? You're some kind of saint. Yeah. Fuck, Fuck off, Pam! Pam. No, you've been a good friend And that's in the thick and thin And I know it's never gonna end Cause you've been a good friend
That's the difference, diff films. <laughs>